Nifty Gateway Tutorial, NFT platform, quick and easy. Hey guys, welcome back to the YouTube channel. Today we will be taking a look at Nifty Gateway. So Nifty Gateway is a digital art platform that allows you to buy, sell, and auction NFTs. It is one of the largest platforms out there after OpenSea, and they also have a App Store application as well as a Google Play application for you to download and get started with your NFT journey. So there are a lot of functionalities with Nifty Gateway. They have the applications you also have the premier marketplace where uh, digital items that you can truly own have been exhibited they also have your simple listing systems which will enable you to get started with your nifty project so you can choose if you're a project creator or just a artist uploading their nfts on their platform and auctioning them so then you also have curated drops and verified drops so they have two basic things verified by the nifty gateway team to be authentic and then you have curated drops where they are sold directly by the creator so whoever is creating is going to be selling those nft and you can buy them here or sell them uh, before they sell out on any other platform or you can purchase them from other secondary marketplaces so uh, the curated ones are going to be very exclusive and have a more appeal a more exclusive appeal to the overall uh, masses of the platform now to get started you can go ahead into the marketplace and browse the different nfts that are available and for you to get started with your own marketplace you're just going to click on sign up over here and then you're going to choose to sign up with either a password or metamask so you have to link your crypto wallet and i'm using metamask over here most people are using metamask for their crypto or nft collection so you're just going to click on sign up with metamask over here once you click on sign up with metamask you're just going to sign up via your email address you're just going to input your email address and then you're going to enter your first name and last name and verify that you are not a robot so once you have verified that you are not a robot you're just going to get a activity form on your metamask account you can see that a new tab will open up this will be a metamask notification and they will ask if you want to connect your metamask account you're going to click on next and then you're going to click on connect over here once you do that you will have a signature request so you're just going to click on sign over here and once you click on sign you're just going to get started and this will load up your email address so you're just going to open up your email that you input on your nifty gateway platform and then you're just going to confirm so you're going to click on verify email in your email so you're going to get this mail once you have done that you're just going to click on continue and then you're going to begin setting up your profile so first off is your profile image what i would recommend for your profile image is probably if you already had any successful nfts to upload any of your previous work or one of your most uh exclusive or whatever you think is your best nft to upload a image of that over here so i'm just going to go into my downloads and i'm just going to use a sample image over here but i would recommend that you use one of your nfts so make sure the file size is less than 2 mbs and once you have uploaded that you're going to enter a few lines now this is going to be your biography you want to make sure it is concise yet it is very illustrative of who, who you are as an artist that as a creator of nfts because the nft marketplace is not going to value you unless you are giving something out of value so you need to be as interesting and as eye-catching for your customers or clients so they are more interested in your work so so over here you're just going to enter you can add something like hi my name is shane and i focus on this kind of nft i've made this kind of content previously whatever is your art style just discuss that a little and then after that you're going to add your budget so let's say we have under 500 usd that is our budget and then you're going to add what kind of items that you are interested in let's say we are interested in this so we're going to click on continue and then you can add your username we're going to click on continue over here and then once you do that you're just going to click on continue click on do this later we're going to do this later as well and now you can see our account has been created once your nifty account has been created you can click on your profile over here and then you have your nifty gateway wallet you have your ethereum wallet and then you have your ethereum wallet address now you can click on over here edit your wallet and then you can click on your account settings over here once you click on your account settings you have your seller settings and you can click on authorize your seller account to become a seller on the nifty platform so this is just going to be a nifty gateway uh, setup and then you just have to click on continue and then you're going to add your phone number and connect stripe and this will get you approval for you to get started with selling nfts as well so you can begin selling your nfts on the nifty platform now 
the best part about the nft platform is that you can auction your nfts so let's say i want to take a look at the listings that are w2w listings and i want to take a look at the curated ones and once i have done that i'm going to put these two filters and just browse the different nfts that are available and people can actually auction off so this is going to be a good feature for people that are not certain about the value of their nfts if you feel like you could get a higher price than what you're selling your nfts on a standard platform like OpenSea, where you have a fixed price and you want to auction them off to see what are the highest bids what is the valuation of your nfts in the nft market then it is going to be a far helpful platform for you to get started with and what you can do is you can just upload your nft you can see the floor price which is going to be the base price of an nft and from the floor price people can auction uh, people can bid for higher obviously the more traction you already have the pre-existing interactions you already have with people are going to help you a lot in terms of getting more in terms of getting more clicks and you can get started with their creator platform you can click on i'm an artist over here click on let's go over here and then you're going to enter your full name you're going to add your email address we're going to click on ok then you're going to add how long you've been an artist for you're going to add all of your genres and then you're just going to add your social media links or portfolios and then you're just going to add if whether or not you have added your nfts on any other platforms we're just going to answer that as no and then you have to enter if you have a specific mind a specific project that you want to upload on nifty gateway as an artist and then you're going to add a video link for you introducing yourself now you are actually going to enter your video link and once you do that you're going to be your profile will be vetted by a person at the nifty gateway platform for you to be vetted as an artist and once they realize you know once they see your introductory video of two to three minutes they're able to see that you are a actual illustrator or a actual artist that is looking to create their portfolio or expand their portfolio on the nifty platform then you're going to be authorized to get started on their platform and upload your nfts and become a curator or a artist on the nifty platform that is the best part about their platform they don't just accept any and everybody it's exclusive it has curated and verified listings and, and it builds more interest in people who are looking for exclusivity in the nft space because marketplaces like OpenSea and other marketplaces are filtered or are stuffed with so many different creators there are everyone is trying to sell nfts just to make money the people are just trying to make a quick buck and actual artists or illustrators are not getting what they deserve so platforms like this focus on the authenticity of the artwork the value behind the art and all of the other uh, security protocols to be followed accurately that's why they verify their own nfts as well so that was it for today i hope you guys found this video helpful make sure to like this video and subscribe to the youtube channel and comment down below the best tips and tricks that i have taught you within this video and make sure to also share this video with your friends and family and to other creators as well so you can help them out as well and to anyone that might need to know this basic detailed platform and how you navigate through these different social websites so i hope this was helpful enough for you and make sure that you do leave a comment down below if i missed out on anything and if there is anything you would like to add and i will catch you guys in the next video